Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Today I'm gonna share with you what I got on my May's Ipsy subscription and also who's gonna be the winner for this month giveaway. So if you're interested in knowing all that, then just keep watching this video, thanks. Well, let's go ahead and get started. The first thing that I want to show you is this adorable bag. I mean, uh, if you've been with Ipsy for a while, you know that they usually send you the kind of bags that are they're more plastic or they usually are not um, fabric and this is fabric it looks very like heavy kind of material recycled kind of thing and i really really like it and i think this is one of the bags from all the ones that i got throughout this year almost a year that i've been with ipsy that i kind of like the most even though it's probably gonna get dirty because it's fabric but i don't know i just think it's cute and i can put my sunscreen and other stuff or my sunglasses to go to the beach or to go to the pool or whatever so i really like this bag the next thing i want to show you is the theme for this month and this is fresh picks and the only thing why i want to show you this it's because as probably most of you know if you get ipsy the bottom is the brands that uh, of products that they will be sending to you and usually you get five products with Ipsy and I don't know I just feel like I don't know many of these brands I mean there's some that I do know like Too Faced like um, Pacifica, Revlon I don't know but there are a lot of brands that I don't really know much about them so let's see what I got in my bag the first thing that I got is this blending brush from Coastal Sense and this is the BRCN08. I like when they send me brushes. I got a Mirabella brush a few months back and that is my holy grail the one that I need to wash every single night to do my makeup every morning. I love that brush so I'm excited that they're still sending me brushes that I can really try and see if I want to invest maybe in on a set from that specific company or not. This is very soft and I think it's very kind of sturdy constructed so I like it. I'm just going to put it to the test and see how it works to do my eye makeup. The next thing I got is something from the company that I don't know anything about it. This is Olive Lips and it's just a Lips. lip ad. It's just, honestly, I have never heard about this brand. It is a clear kind of lip balm yeah. and yeah, I'm excited to try it, see if I like it. Um, I don't know yet. I tried it once but it did, I didn't think it was anything amazing or better than my usual my usual Vaseline that I use for my lips so let's see how it works the next thing is something from another brand that I, I, I heard about but I've never tried anything it's the the pure brand and this is a pure moist hydra balance moisturizer in normal to dry sensitive anti-aging moisturizer <laughs> such a long name uh, i'm excited to try this i think it's a great size this is 0.5 ounces but usually what i get in this bigger sizes i can really have an idea if i want to buy the full size or not then something that it was really weird and i kind of knew the they were sending this sunscreen this is the hang 10 50 classic sport it's supposed to be a natural sunscreen with uva and uvb protection this is broad spectrum spf 50 water resistant but the funny thing is that hang 10 was one of those brands that used to make jeans when i was a teenager so and it's the same kind of logo and everything so i don't know if they started making sunscreen and they stopped making clothes or what the deal is but i like the jeans so let's see if i like this sunscreen as much as i love the jeans back in the day the last thing that i got is a duo by pacifica and i've heard great things about pacifica eyeshadows from different youtubers the first thing is the lid broke but that's all right uh this is uh duo and i don't usually wear duos that much i don't know why but i have such a hard time to create looks with duos i feel like they're chalky and not very good pigmentation i don't know i mean you can see it but i can't see the contrast the bottom one it's really really chalky and so i don't know if i like this that much i'm gonna try to use it and see if i can come up with any looks or otherwise i'm just gonna pass it along i don't know i feel like there are other elf duos or elf eyeshadows that they're not as chalky as this 
so we'll see how it works. Well girls, that was it and uh, that's everything I got. Honestly, I don't know, I'm not really excited about this month Ipsy subscription. The only thing that I really am happy that they sent me is the brush. The other things I'm sure I'm gonna use but I don't know, I mean, I'm not excited, not too excited about them. So I know it's summertime or it's almost summertime and we do need sunscreen, we need a good moisturizer, we need lip balm, I do get it, but I don't know if that's what I was expecting from my Ipsy subscription. I think I was expecting more fun colors, maybe eyeshadows or eyeliners or something fun for the summertime that can really get us excited. Anyways, I'm not gonna, you know, I'm not gonna complain about it, it was just 10 bucks. It, it gets me the opportunity to try different things. It's just that I was expecting more makeup, mm, summer related to this specific bag. So anyways, thank you for watching this video until the end. Like every month I have a giveaway and this is for the number one fan in my YouTube page. There's a little tab that it says who out of I don't know what period has been liking the most videos or watching more videos or whatever and it becomes the number one fan and that's the one that it's gonna get the prize every single month so really excited for this month's winner I'm gonna list it at the end of this video so please contact me and let me know your address or whatever you want me to send your prize so thank you for watching this video until the end I love you guys and I will see you in tomorrow's video Mwah.